Yo, 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 you already know, it's your boy Freddy O. What's up, Afria crew, cannabis crew, stock crew, Neo crew, everybody crew. Guys, how's it going, man? In this video today, I'm gonna tell you what stocks to buy with your next stimulus check coming up, and also why I think those stimulus checks are coming sooner than later, guys. And also we're gonna take a look at, like I said, stocks to buy with that stimulus check. You know what I mean? But if you could, if it's your first time, smash that like button give me a nice little thumb you know what i mean so sorry so more people can see this content and so you can show me that love and also guys subscribe to my channel you already know it's your boy freddy yo let's get right into it guys all right guys so stocks to buy with your stimulus checks there's three um sectors in 2021 i believe are gonna blow the biggest all right number one obviously you guys know i'm all about the cannabis i'm all about you know, people relaxing and you know what I mean? Shareholders making that money. So cannabis is number one. Number two, obviously there's no doubt in my mind, there should be no doubt in your mind either, that EV sector is going up. Electric vehicles will be the future, man, period. Don't even doubt yourself. If you're saying no, no, my gas powered car is gonna be here and forever. Bro, get your old fashioned mentality out of here. Move on with your life. Uh, next, guys, the, the other thing to buy with your, with your stimulus checks, stocks that I'm very looking at, green stocks, guys. Stocks that are, 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 are good for the environment. Those are the stocks people uh, I, or that I believe are going to blow up in 2021 and beyond. All right? All right, guys. So let's keep going. Let's get into it. All right? So let's start off. Um, uh, those are my stock picks, right? The, or, or my uh, sectors. But let me tell you why, before I tell you a little bit about those stocks, let me tell you why I think those stimulus checks are coming out sooner than later, guys. You ready? Uh, right now, right now, Republicans, I'm sorry, trying, trying to be as unbiased as possible. Right now, Republicans are saying, you know, on TV and in public, that there's no need for more stimulus. Shut your damn... I'm sorry, that's ridiculous. They say there's no need for more stimulus after that weak $600 check they gave out to Americans. Sad. All right, but anyways, guys, too bad Republicans, they don't have control no more. Now we're gonna get stuff done. Um, so this is what's going on, guys. They do not have control, so they can say that, that they don't wanna do stimulus, Republicans, but it doesn't matter what they say, honestly. Um, Democrat... Democrats, Democrat, uh, Democrats have what what's called the the Budget Reconciliation Act. All right, guys, what is that? What's the Budget Reconciliation Act? Pretty much, it means nine times in the next two years that Chuck Schumer is pres or is um is a uh, Senate Majority Leader. In the next next two years, um, they will pass legislation whether Republicans care or not. Meaning they don't need Republicans to, do, it doesn't matter what they think. There's nine times in the next two years that Democrats are going to do whatever they want. And um, the number one thing on Ch uh, Chuck Schumer's list, he says, we're going to use this act, this Budget Reconciliation Act, to go ahead and speed up and get these stimulus checks out that the people are waiting for. All right. So um, that basically what that means is nine times out of the year, they don't have to do what's called the filibuster. The filibuster is uh, a thing where you need 60 votes out of 100 votes to pass something. But um, Democrats don't need that crap. But they only need the 50 plus one Kamala Harris to get that, uh, that legislation passed. So that's great for the stock market because when we all know stimulus means the stock market goes up, baby. And that's what that's why I'm telling you guys this at the end of the day. I'm not trying to be biased. I'm trying to be pro money. All right. I'm sorry to say that the Democrats at this point are way pro money. All right, they're, they're trying to help us grow while the other ones are doing what? Lowballing us and giving us a six, saying $600 was enough for you guys. Huh? Shut that bullshit. I didn't say that. Uh, all right, guys. Anyway, uh, let's see, guys. A uh, sidebar, another sidebar, guys. Biden is passing a bill that will speed up stimulus. So not only is Chuck Schumer and the Democrats in the Senate uh, ready to speed this up, Joe Biden is also saying, let's go, let's get this stimulus out. Like he's going to pass a bill that's going to force everybody to do their jobs and move forward, man. Because we're just, what are we doing? What, are we, what have we done the last freaking years during this pandemic? Except let people 
tank. You know what I mean? Unless you've been following me on, on my channel, you've been making money all year long because, uh, you know, that's what we do on this channel. All right, guys. All right, so let's go back, guys. Let's go back. So stocks to buy for the cannabis sector, guys. You guys already know. I, you guys know what's my favorite stock. Shout out to the Afria crew. crew. The king of the north, Afria, is my favorite stock to buy in 2021. Um, you know, buy the dips, guys. Don't don't just buy a peak and be like, oh, my God. But I honestly, I, right now, the peak, I could see Afria going up. Another one, guys, Tilray, obviously, they're connected with Afria. That's a great buy. Any stock going to the USA that has ties with the USA, USA is the biggest market. That is going to be where the money is, guys. The biggest market, uh, Canopy Growth. There's another good example. Kramer loves Canopy Growth. Um, obviously, you never hear uh, Kramer talking about Afria because he's probably way more invested in Canopy Growth. And he knows that Afria is going to uh, eventually pass Canopy. So, he, you know what I mean? Um... He's just trying to, oh my God, oh my God, I don't, wanna, I don't want my shareholders. Shut up, shut up, Kramer. All right, next, guys, Cure Leaf. Cure Leaf is a good one. Um, they're huge in Florida, man. I, there's a Cure Leaf down the street from me, you know, that I see them a lot here. Uh, another one, True Leaf. True Leaf is good as well. A uh, big company down here in the States, in the US. Planet 13, guys, I know, if, I always mention Planet 13, that's in Las Vegas. Eventually, they're going to get more of these stores open. It's a it's a cool thing. Planet 13 has this, like, cool factor. It's like, uh, you, you go there and everybody's, you know, obviously everybody smokes cannabis that goes to Planet 13. So, you're in a big group of people that are, you know, in an, it's a happy environment. It's almost like a big mall. And it's just, it's cool. And um, things that are cool, uh, you know, tend to... Make revenue, guys. You know what I'm saying? All right, guys. Next, stocks to buy in the EV sector, guys. I was going to do an E. E. V. Nah, that epic fail, guys. My freaking B. All right, guys. Stocks to buy in the EV sector. Go. Number one. Number one. Number one. Number one. Number one. And the biggest growth stock, I think, that's going to be in 2021. I got NEO, baby. Who doesn't have NEO as the biggest growth stock? Who thinks that NEO's not going to be $100 in 2021? You crazy, bro. Or over $100. Who, who knows where it's going? But NEO is going up. NEO has too many things uh, good. The battery is a swap. They're, they're, they're doing subscription services, all right? If, if, if NEO gets to, to, to 100,000 cars being sold, and 50,000, uh, they already said 50% uh, of all being, uh, vehicles sold is um, are, are getting the subscription services, right? Guess what? Uh, the autonomous driving is going to be a subscription service. So that, let's say they're making $200 off those 50,000 cars. That's I think that's $10 million every month, right? In 12 months, they're generating revenue, $120 million off of 50,000 cars. What about when there's 500,000 cars on the road? Then there's going to be so 50,000 or 500,000 cars, right? Now we have 250,000 people subscribing per month uh, at $200 an hour, guys, or $200 or $200 a month, you know what I mean? 250,000, so we went from, um, what is it, 10 million a month, multiply that by, what, five, now you're at uh, 10 million, you're at 50 million a month, 50 million a month, 10, 50 million in, in 10 months is 500 million, so plus, two, plus another two months is 600 million, so you're looking at half a billion dollars in revenue just off a of subscription. If they can get up to 500,000 cars sold a year, come on guys, that's this is and that's that's per year imagine when that that they're just gonna keep stacking guys they're gonna get to a million subscriptions one day and they're gonna be making two hundred dollars to three hundred dollars per subscription oh my god neo is gonna be on freaking fire in 2021 mark my words bro you heard it here okay that's that's my number one stock guy also guys tesla can't go wrong with tesla tesla is a cult stock you know what I mean? It's got, uh, people love Tesla. If 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 Elon Musk farts right now, the stock will go up. You know what I mean? That's just how it is. That's the game. You know what I mean? Uh, uh, it's a cult stock. People love Tesla. You know, I, I personally think Neo is is is. I would rather have a Neo car over Tesla. But what advantage does Tesla have over Neo is the 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 length of time in the game. You know what I mean? Neo's Neo's a baby. Tesla's a grown man, so uh, that's the. But eventually, Neil's gonna catch Tesla, and I want to see what happens then. But I love Tesla going up. Tesla, you keep going up. You keep going up because the higher Tesla goes up, so go way to go, Tesla shareholders. Keep going up. The more you go up, 
the more rain, the more room for growth Neo has. Because if people see Tesla, the, the number one um, uh, electric vehicle doing good, imagine what they're gonna do when there's uh, a Neo car that's selling mass produced. And it's, I'm sorry, it's a cooler car. You got no me, you got all those subscriptions. You don't have to, uh, you, uh, you don't have to charge a battery. You can just switch it. Come on now, there's, there's too many things going on. They got Neo houses that people, you know, just because you own a Neo car, you get to chill in, in some place. You can, you can have some coffee made for you, you know what I mean? And there's, there's a cool factor with Neo. Neo's even doing uh, wine and stuff. Oh, damn, but I'm talking about Tesla, ain't I? Oh well, all right guys. And these are maybes for the EV sector I got for you guys. These are maybes for me. I got X-Pung, maybe. Lee Auto, maybe. Quantum Scape, big maybe. But they just don't offer what Neo and Tesla bring to the table. So for that reason, I don't, you know, you, you buy those if you want. But I like stocks that I know are going to bring me a return. You know what I mean? So I know Neo and Tesla are those stocks. Neo more because Neo's cheap. Tesla's kind of pricey right now. That's, that stock could drop right now to $600. It's $800 something. I'm not willing to lose $250 a share. I don't have that kind of money. I'm not rich. I'm not like some of these guys with 30,000 shares of Tesla. Uh, bro, I'm, I'm just a regular dude, man. Lastly, guys, green stocks to buy. All right? Green stocks. Green stocks will be blowing up. Joe Biden's the president. You know what I mean? He wants to promote green. Uh, he wants to make the world a better place. China right now is going through hell with, with all the, the, the pollution in the air and smog. So they want to go green. The, Europe is going green. Everybody's going green. Everybody knows that we're going away from gas-powered vehicles and so or, or just gas power at all. So um, these are some stocks, guys. One stock, big stock, I bought earlier this year and I sold too early. Vivint Smart Home or Vivint Solar, guys. That is a great stock. They do solar panels and stuff, and they were so cheap earlier in 2020, man. I, I wish I held that stock. I sold it. Damn it. Um, but it's doing really good. Check out that stock, guys. Another solar company is called Solar Edge. They're real expensive. I saw them like up in the $300 a share. But earlier in 2021, they were like a $70. Or 2020, they were like a $70, guys. Believe me, these stocks are going to... Uh, electric... Um, Green stocks are going. All right, so any stock as well, guys. Another thing, green stocks. Any stock that has to do with battery power, uh, stocks like ChargePoint, um, you know, just car charging, uh, lithium, uh, all these battery things. Guys, those are, that's, those are the money makers because everybody's going away from gasoline power, guys. Um, yeah. All right, guys, that is my video for you guys today. You already know it's your boy Freddie O, guys. If you enjoyed this video, if I, you know, entertained you, please, guys, smash that like for me, man. I do this just for fun. Uh, I do this for you guys. You know, I'm on my lunch break. I got to be at work in five minutes, but I'm going to get this video done just for you guys. You know what I mean? And also, guys, you already know it's your boy Freddie O. Subscribe to my channel, guys. Hit that little bell, too, man, so you can see this when it comes out. All right, later.